Yes, sir, it's your boy, the Sports Gaming, guys. We have some NCAA Basketball 10, Indiana Hoosiers, Dynasty, and our first game is against Middle Tennessee. It is at home, and so here we go. See the star watch for us is the small forward. For them is their shooting guard. And no, I do not have the rosters updated. So you are just going to see center, number 45, stuff like that. So here we go, first quarter now, a little later in the first quarter. Five minute, I'm doing five minute quarters and, and one there for the Hoosier center. He would later then. Look at this, he gets nice pass bumped, and here's the fee, here's the, his free throw, it is up, and he's going to miss it, and so it is still 3 not 2 nothing Indiana, Indiana working with the ball, and they are going to pass it outside, the shot is not going to fall, rebound middle Tennessee, they, dr they drive the ball down the, the court, and they will now try to get on the board as well. Inside pulls up and it's no good. Rebound Indiana. They cannot do anything on the next possession. So Middle Tennessee will get it back. They dish it inside. Turn, uh, fakes inside, misses, rebound, and he puts it back up and in. The game is now tied at two. Here comes Indiana trying to take the lead. The pass is high. But they recover from that, and it's stolen. And so here comes Middle Tennessee. He's running the floor. He's going to pull back. Stolen there by Indiana. Here they come on the fast break. Two on two. He's going to pull back again. Goes to the middle, and it's stolen again. Another turnover for Indiana. Middle Tennessee, and that's no. Big job by Middle Tennessee, and the floater goes. Four to two. 40 seconds left. Indiana looking to score here. No, leaning in. Dishes right back out. Not a shot that they were going to take. Having the power forward take a three. No, I didn't think so. Turn around jumper. No, Mi rebound middle Tennessee. And this is where things get a little weird. Uh, the, has, the half end is the shoot. Power forward has the ball. And he makes a three at the buzzer from about half court. And that um, put Indiana up 5-4 to four going into half, as you see the score there. There's that shot again. Sinks it. It's still 5-4. Down low. Going up with it. And it's going to rim out. So rebound Middle Tennessee. They're going to go inside. And his layup is missed. Gets his own rebound. And he puts it right back up and in. So now it's 6-5 Middle Tennessee. Inside, pulls up, good, 7-6, to six. Indiana leads. Now a 9-8 to eight game. Middle Tennessee with the ball once again. Driving, no good, rebound Indiana. They're going to run down the court. Passes it to the right corner, and he pulls up, he's blocked. Middle Tennessee saves it, but it goes right out of bounds. So Indiana will retain possession. Passes it in. Kicks it out. Shots up. And the three is good! 12 to 8 now. Indiana leads. And um, if you guys didn't know, uh, this past college basketball season has a nice block there. Indiana had a nail biter going down with Kentucky, the number one ranked Kentucky. Uh, both teams are 8-0. And I was actually watching it right here. I was reading for Indiana. I like, and another uh, two there, so it's 14-8. I like Indiana. They're, got, they've always had a good program, and they're really good this year, in my opinion. Um, I had them in my bracket, I think, going to maybe the Elite Eight. Um, but... Like I was saying, they had a number one Kentucky. Both teams are 8-0. The game was right here in Indiana. The crowd was excited. And here's, um, and so they, 
here's the weird thing. I believe it was during like spring break, so no students were there. So it was regular uh, alumni that had come, and it was going back and forth game, back and forth. Um, then Kentucky pulled, then Indiana came, and so Indiana is down, I believe, 80 to 78. They're coming down the court. They have about maybe I want to say a little less than 10 seconds. They run down the court and um, they shoot a three with one second and they nail it to win the game and upset the number one Kentucky Wildcats. This is, I just think, what the heck there. I didn't feel like shooting free throws and so I took a deep three that I shouldn't have taken and I missed it as their Middle Tennessee is just going to continue to foul and it looks like Indiana is going to have this wrapped up. They're up 16 to 10. These are five minute quarters so the games are a little low scoring. Plus, I'm not very good at shooting, and um, but I play really good defense. I see that's the game there. Indiana beats Middle Tennessee by the final score of 16 to 10. They improved to uh, 1 and 0 on the season as Middle Tennessee drops to 0 and 1 on the season. So, guys, um, this has been um, NCAA basketball Wednesdays. Um, tune in tomorrow for NBA 2K12 with our Bucks Association and our point guard. And so, um, yeah, this was it. Um, final score, Indiana 16, Middle Tennessee 10. And this concludes, like I said, NCAA Wednesdays. This is the Sports Gaming Guys saying see you next time. See you guys.